My name's Bex Francis. I'm a physiotherapist within the community rehab team in the northwest of Glasgow. I work for NHS Greater Glasgow and Clyde. So physiotherapy for me, I really like patient satisfaction, seeing people progress, achieving things that they never thought they would achieve, getting back their independence a little bit more. We do in the community work within people's homes and in their house settings. We also then work in our offices here as more of a wider team. So I do think the communication within that multidisciplinary team is really important in the fact that then the patient gets a better outcome. My interest in it stemmed from me having knee surgery five years ago and then going through the process myself. So I didn't really have a typical route into physiotherapy. I came back as a mature student to do my MSc that I've just completed. I also have a hearing impairment. I've had it since I was about two years old and it's just been kind of a gradual hearing loss but I've also then suffered with tinnitus over the top of it. But with a few adaptations that have been made for me has meant that I've been able to complete my degree and I'm able to hear people in meetings and communicate with patients really well. I have a little device that attaches to my hearing aids, so I'm able to hear a lot of people at once. I have specialist headphones that I use for when we're doing meetings on teams, things like that really. I always say to people, don't be afraid of telling people that you've got a disability because people can only help if they know about it. For a student that wants to get into physiotherapy, I would say don't hesitate. Show people that you're keen. And if you do have a disability or an impairment as such, don't let that stop you. Find your adaptations that work for you and communicate those to the people that you're going to be working with. I really love being a physiotherapist. No two days are really the same and it really does make a difference to people's lives. It's just amazing.